Hey, what's up guys? I'm just gonna do a quick deeper dive into the two inch radius lower tool from yesterday. It seems there's still a few of you guys that are a little confused on how it works. So I wanted to do a little bit deeper of a dive uh, to kind of enlighten you guys a little bit and hopefully this is a learning moment and it helps you guys understand what's going on. So here is the tool from yesterday, two inch radius. So what I did is I got a section of four inch 120 wall tube off the shelf. So it's four inch OD, which makes the ID three and three quarter. So if we take our two inch radius gauge, we line that up here on the outside, you can see that's a two inch. And then we come back over, and you can see it's a two inch. But then we can take this tool. It's not gonna be perfect because we're talking about a four inch OD versus a three and three quarter ID but you can see how close it is just to prove that this is in fact a two inch radius tool. A lot of people think because of the width of this that you're not going to be able to achieve a two inch radius across it. But like I said, showing that the two inch radius fits, and this is four inch diameter tube, OD, two inch there, it is in fact a two inch radius anvil.